And now, your Precision 18 forecast. News 18. Weather from where you live. Scattered rainfall for some of us. Others pretty much bone dry today, but nonetheless, we are tracking more of that scattered rainfall throughout Greater Lafayette. You can see more of a sustained rain across parts of Pulaski as well as Fulton counties. Off to the southeast of that, uh, some more pulsy pop up showers and storms just north of Rossville, uh, east of Frankfort, southwest of Kokomo, seeing some of the heavier rainfall. But for the most part, our southwestern counties remain dry at this hour. And it's all thanks to the southerly wind flow, the heat, and some of that humidity we've dealt with throughout the day as well. A round of low pressure far off to our northwest, generating the showers and storms across parts of central and eastern Illinois. Those should continue to fall apart in the coming hours as they make their way ever so closer to greater Lafayette. But nonetheless, temperatures across the region warm. We saw, the, in fact, the warmest day on record so far for 2016. 87 degrees right now in New Richmond, the same in Ladoga. We're at 76 in Galveston, 68 degrees in Monticello right now. A few little showers rolling through, dropping temperatures briefly before we begin to see them climb right back up into the 70s throughout the viewing area. 88 degrees today. That is 10 degrees above average for this time of the year. And once again, the warmest temperature of La for Lafayette of 2016, mainly cloudy skies. Skies, winds from the southwest 8 miles per hour. We're looking at that frontal boundary just to the north of us. Another cold front to our west. Notice all the scattered showers and storms within that warm sector. That's the area behind the warm front, but ahead of the cold front. That's where we find ourselves right now. So on and off showers and storms, possibly as late as about 11 p.m. We stay dry throughout the overnight hours, but notice the rain just to the west of us by tomorrow morning at 7. Your snapshot forecast this evening, Audrey Hardback sending in this beautiful image from near Fowler. The sunset there, 83 degrees your temperature by 7 p.m., falling off to around 69 degrees by midnight here in Lafayette. Overnight lows dipping down into the mid to low 60s, 63 degrees in West Lafayette tonight, 61 degrees as you kick off your Thursday, or I should say uh, tomorrow morning commute, 61 degrees your uh, temperature uh, in Logansport. Going ahead, notice the frontal boundary sinking a little bit further to the south tomorrow morning, but more importantly, that cold front to our west making its way ever so closer by, by 3 to 4 p.m. tomorrow. That's when we see that line of showers and storms enter our western counties, some of which could bring the potential for severe weather. That's why the Storm Prediction Center of America has placed much of our northwestern portion of the viewing area under a marginal risk for severe weather. The main threats from some of these storms will be hail larger than an inch in diameter and wind gusts in excess of 60 miles per hour. So certainly a situation we'll keep our eyes on for Wednesday. But once that cold front rolls through late Wednesday night, early Thursday morning, things dry out. We're looking at some pretty nice conditions for Thursday and Friday. Scattered showers and storms return on Saturday thanks to a passing round of low pressure. But look at those temperatures gradually falling as that forecast goes on. Yeah, that'll feel pretty good too. Yeah, definitely. All right, thanks. Yeah. Well, some big